Hi everybody, it's Get Real in the Kitchen with Deanna Olson and we had that butterscotch pudding and it all got eaten. It was yum and I had leftover butterscotch. So I'm bringing you butterscotch chips trail mix and there's a reason why. So let's go into that. First of all, let's just make the trail mix. Now these are things I actually had around the house because I'm very fortunate because sometimes I feel like I have nothing. And I put these in alphabetical order for no particular reason, just to be a goof. Some sliced almonds, half a cup of apricots, dried apricots, half a cup of dried cherries, about a fourth of a cup of currants, that I use for baking, and about a cup of peanuts. Um, and I tend to pick these up when they're on sale, that's why I had these. And last but not least, a half a cup of butterscotch chips. Now, this is now done and ready and mixed together. Now let me just give you a couple ideas here, but. We should find out if it tastes good, right? So, oh my, a convenient hand reached there. <laughs> One of the peanuts, something fell on the floor. Oh. Good. So, these are little stack bags, so I'm just going to do one to show you, but I'm going to fill these little snack bags up like this. And <clears throat> When I get them, and as I fill them, I'm going to put them in some somewhere where there's like that's where the snack bags are. And the reason is that is that having this. So what happens is, and I've done this. I bring a bag of chocolate chips into the house, and I eat the entire bag in three days, and I don't even make the chocolate chip cookies. So when you have this sort of thing left over, chocolate chips, butterscotch chips, any kind, of, think about making something like this with what you have on hand. Because what you can do is grab this, you can put it in the kids' lunches. You could, this is really, really especially good for taking with you when you're out running errands, gonna be gone for quite a while. Hiking, biking, all, taking walks. And when you have um, this kind of stuff on hand with you and, and water in the car, there's so much less chance that you're gonna have to stop. And for fast food, and you know that bill runs up. So, plus, so, problem solved. Didn't eat all those extra leftover chips. Have something healthy to take with with us, and save money from from eating out. So, this is uh, live from Denver. One take. See you next time.